An IB student, for me, they go above and beyond the lower cognitive levels of memorization or basic understanding. They're critical thinkers. I love the IB learner profile, which runs from kindergarten all the way through to grade 12. And those attributes, our students will know them and they will comment on them. They've studied them, they've thought about them through the years. So I do think they are principled, they're critical thinkers, they're communicators. I love the fact that even within the curriculum, it's not just an add-on, within the curriculum, you're assessed on things like your presentation skills or collaborating with others, learning and, and teaching others is an absolutely fundamental way of reinforcing your own learning. So for me, that, the learner profile and the approaches to learning, so research skills, communication skills is just fundamental. It's, it's great for learning for life. I was delighted to be asked by GEMS to run a four programme IB school. I really appreciate the continuum actually. We've done the research for example on how well our students do with their outcomes the longer they've been in the school and I'm really pleased to say that came out perfectly for me as a head running a four programme school. The longer they'd been with us, therefore even PYP, MYP, the better their outcomes in the DP. It was almost linear, you know, so it's perfect to say the MYP led beautifully into the DP and the CP. We had the DP for everyone and it's a, it's a lovely programme, but it is prescribed breadth, right? Not everyone wants to continue with every one of those subjects within it. So we thought we'll do the CP and see what happens. We've got business and entrepreneurship. We've got creative media. We had sport and we've got some interesting, really interesting links with industry and with other universities. So we're the only school in the UAE to link with Embry-Riddle, for example, which is the oldest aeronautical aviation university in the world. And we're a center of excellence at GEMS International School for Aeronautics, Aviation and Space. So some really exciting moves within the CP at GIS, GEMS International School. And also for the students who've chosen that track, that's 25% of them. So it's obviously suited a lot of our students to have that extra pathway. I think it aligns rather than transforms it. I, my leadership style, I think I want voices from within, so students to have a voice, staff to have a voice, and I think outstanding schools are not echo chambers. And I think the IB aligns to that as well. I think it's helped me in the sense of learning from a lot of very um, accomplished IB leaders around the world. So that's improved my own leadership, coming to conferences and workshops. I think the IB professional development has been very good for me and my colleagues as well. So I've learned from that. I would recommend other schools look very seriously at the IB continuum. We have many students that join grade 10, even straight into grade 11. But if you're in the IB earlier, you really, you learn about the learner profile, the ATL skills, schools have the time to be able to inculcate the skills and the thinking of an IB student before you hit those final two years. And I believe in transdisciplinary anyway. If you can make common themes and contextual points of, of interest within those subjects, then I think that represents the workplace more and the way we function.